Americas, one of the most developed continents in the world, were not the same as today. To learn about its discovery, let's go back to the 15th century. In 1492, an Italian explorer and navigator, Christopher Columbus, in his first voyage, encountered the Americas, the North America, Central America, South America and the Caribbean Islands. These continents were completely unknown in Europe, Asia and Africa and were outside of the world's political and economic system. In a nutshell, these were isolated continents. Columbus did four voyages to the Americas. For his first voyage, he convinced the King of Spain to send him on a mission to find a better trade route to India, not by traveling east over land, but by sailing towards west. So, on the evening of 3rd August 1492, Columbus departed with three ships and first sailed to Castile. He departed from Castile on 6th of September for what turned out to be a five-week voyage across the ocean. On October 12, the crew finally sighted land and reached an island which is now called the Bahamas. Columbus thought that he had finally made it to India through the west, but he was mistaken. As the people living there had florid complexion, Columbus named them as Red Indians and that island as San Salvador, which means Holy Savior. The reason behind giving the island this name was that if Columbus and his crew never had landed on an island, they would have died due to the shortage of food and this island saved their lives. In this way, Christopher Columbus introduced America to Europe and to the rest of the world. But Columbus was not the first European to make landfall in the Americas. In the 10th century, the Vikings, led by Leif Erikson, preceded Columbus and his crew. They lived here and built settlements for a short period of time and then left. However, Columbus's voyages were the ones that led to the ongoing European contact with the Americas. On the other side, Columbus's arrival had adverse effects on the Native Americans as 90% of their population was wiped out. Not only this, Columbus is also accused of tyranny and slavery. Anyways, from 1792 till this day, Columbus Day is celebrated in the United States and Latin America on 12th October, also known as Feliz Dia de la Raza or Native American Day. Christopher Columbus died on 20th of May 1506 in Spain, aged about 54 years. Columbus, until his last day, never claimed that he discovered a new world. It was Amerigo Vespucci, an Italian explorer who proved that America is not in Asia's eastern outskirts. And so, in 1507, a German cartographer published a world map calling the new continent America, from Vespucci's Latinized name, Americas. For more stuff like this, subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon beside it. Our next video would be...